Howdy, howdy. Uh, it's STP again. Tonight we'll be talking about power and damage. Um, I'm actually playing Calistar because Calistar highlights the two main uh, important things about power. One, uh, the damage gap. Uh, the damage gap is essentially how much damage you do versus how much damage your opponent does. Uh, Calist you can achieve this in two ways. One through uh, bonus power uh, in your style. So this is plus one, this is plus three, and so on. And then the other way you can get additional damage is through soak. Uh, Calistar in her human form, every one of her styles have soak. So she is the the queen, the 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 queen of of damage. So we're gonna be playing her for for that, which is all about uh, all about the um, damage gap. And then the other thing that Calistar does is reach. So essentially, reach is a concept of how much damage you can. Uh, uh, kill at. So if they're at 6 life, can you do 6 damage? Or if they're at 9 life, can you do 9 damage? Well, most characters can only do maybe 3, 4, maybe 5 damage, which means you can play pretty aggressively, even as low as uh, 4 life. Um, but Kalistar, especially in her I'm on fire, everyone has to die um, uh, form, she can hit really hard. Um, to the point where she's actually, uh, um, yeah, she can do, I think, 10 damage tops. Uh, so she has huge reach, and which is why we're going to be playing Galastar. I'm actually not much of an expert with Galastar, so forgive me for, uh, uh, mistakes that I will make. But, yeah, that's what we're going to learn about tonight. So I'm going to actually start with Caustic Shot. Uh, the reason is, is that Caustic essentially has a, uh, four advantage in terms of uh, damage advantage. It has a soap 3 and a plus 1 power. Um, and yeah, we're playing against Magdalene. Magdalene is a late game character. Um, normally, uh, I would be focusing on rushing her down, which is kind of what we'll be doing uh, before she gets to later stages. I assume she will probably dodge me early on, either this speed or next. Uh, but yeah, we're going to be... Uh, kind of focusing on damage tonight, trying to do as much uh, damage capping early on, and then once I get her maybe below 10, we'll switch to murder death mode and try to, to one-shot her. So yeah. Um, she clashes me. She's not very good here. Let's see what she got. She can retreat. She could drive, which would be a problem. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm going slow here, right? Yeah. I guess we will strike. Uh, it's probably incorrect. It probably should have. Uh... Oh, looks like strike's gonna work out. Double clash. Okay. Well, I don't think she has advance at this point. No, other than dodge, she doesn't have advance. So that means she's going to have to be a distance between, I'm going to go with, I guess, burst. I guess I should have won the spell ball. No, she's going to dodge me. Okay. I guess this is fine. Uh, this means I will probably be able to get center if she dodges past me. Yeah, like I said, she'll be dodging early. Um, one of the weaknesses of Calistar is that her forms have a lot of the same priority, so a lot of zeros in this case. Or, uh, so she will be clashed a lot. That's kind of how you beat Calistar, uh, is by clashing her style. So you'll see a lot of clashing I see. Um, but Tyrakin here is no slouch. She's uh, one of the better players. Um, so he'll definitely be uh, clashing a bunch because he's uh, you know what he's doing. 
<laughs> we, we know it's much better way he's doing it than I do. So I would trust him, but we'll see. So, let's see what's going on. So his dodge is down, which means he cannot dodge me. Um, I think I'm going to do something crazy this peak. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to do something crazy this peak. How much stun guard? He's not, see, she has stun guard zero here. I guess you could do this, you could take more than three. Huh, interesting. I was thinking about doing a, um, a flare, like a flare drive, because he can't clash that, and I can just, like, absolutely smash or aid him. Uh, if he does Sanctimonious, I'm going to cry, for safety, I mean. I'm gonna cry. Aww. Aww, aww, aww. Interesting. You cannot take more damage than your level plus two. Hmm. Is he gonna think that I'm gonna go for that? That's the question. I don't think he's going to. I don't think he's gonna figure on it. I'm actually gonna do this. Uh, so even though this does 3 damage to me, it gives me plus 3 power, so uh, if I do hit for 6, which I could potentially hit for 6 here, then uh, we will essentially um, trade even. I don't know. Is, this cra is it crazy? Am I being crazy? Yeah, so basically it's going to be a 6 okay. to 0 B. So... Uh, 6 to 3 beats because it does 3 damage to me. So I still will have a effective uh, damage lead of 3, just like I was talking about before using it. So, so I'm doing something crazy. This may go horribly wrong. I don't know. Jerkin's a good player. We'll see what he does here. What do you do? Go. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Take six. I will take zero. zero. <laughs> oh, nice. You won't gain a trance either. Wow. So good. So good. Alright. And one. Smack into six. Yeah. Good. Good deal. Wham. Oh, nice. So, even though it did three to me, I actually got three ahead there on that beat. So, um, you know, this is, again goes to that that concept of uh, uh, damage difference. Um, I did do six, but it did do three to me, so it was essentially just three ahead, but... Um, three ahead is, is not, not bad. Um, so what is he going to do this round? I assume he's going to do some sort of blessing to get his life back. <laughs> so that can have a three drain, I can push it here, and I can tweet two, but then he can do one. Yeah, no, so that one, two, three. Two, three, move here, move forward, and do the other. I think this is what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna do safety blazing. This way I can outspeed everything that he could do at this point. Yeah, I'm gonna outspeed him. I'm gonna outspeed him. No okay. time to wait. Ready when you are. Uh, this isn't a huge damage. It only does two, but again. Um, 2-0, it does put me to a head. The reason I'm actually doing this is I'm assuming he's going to uh, try to uh, gain life with his special, his blessing. Um, I'm going to put one more damage in here because, yeah, why not? Uh, I assume he's going to try to use blessing here to gain through life. And I think if I do this, I can uh, make it, uh, in this case, since I am the power of 3 0 beat. So, uh, yeah, that's my plan here. Uh, we might be switching forms pretty soon here because, uh, 
Um, I really want to try to deal damage to him before he can get to his higher levels. So, there we go. Perfect. Yeah, this is great. Whack him for three, shove him back. Three, two, this will get me out of. Um, get me out of. Um, <clears throat> Uh, dodging so he can't actually dodge past me. It's perfect. Perfect, perfect. Yep, yep, yep. And then we will retreat to two. Yep. So yeah, it, you know, in these last two weeks, the damage gap, the last, the first one I hit was six to him, three to me, that got me three ahead. This is three to him, zero to me. So you can see this damage gap really adds up, you know, at 6 damage, it's currently 17 to 11. So, you know, um, I didn't use Soak uh, to get that, but yeah, you can see how the damage gap, even if it's 1 or 2, over the course of a couple weeks, it can become huge, like, like it has in this case. So, the question is, he's around 10. I think I want to hit him one more time before we switch to... Uh, to Calistar murder mode, but I don't know. We could switch to Calistar murder mode, try to knock him out, but I think I think we're gonna go one more round here. So let's see what we want to do. Hmm, I'm pretty slow, and he knows I'm pretty slow in this case. So what is he gonna do? He still has Blessing, Safety, how much move does he have? He has Dodge, Drive, so he doesn't have a lot of forward motion. Not a lot of forward motion. Yeah, 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 yeah. And he doesn't have a lot of range, so he's got very limited range. So he's either Dodge or Shot. Um, so I think I'm going to go Snowball. Perhaps try to go fast with Skullbolt. That's crazy. Sure. So Spellbolt is another example of damage gap. If I hit him because I'm going faster, I'll give him minus two power. So minus two power and the Silk One, it's all it all adds up to be a huge damage gap. Now, if he moves it all, I'm gonna be sad here. Uh, but I I think he will not move here. Um, I'm hoping. So yeah, I guess we'll just uh, let go. If I hit him for three here, I will definitely switch to murder mode. A lot of fun. All right, what you doing? What you doing, man? So one thing to note is he does have strike in his uh, discard, which means his stun guard. Um, he won't have a big stun guard, so I could do another flare beat um, if he's uh, if his dodge is down. He might be flare again. Um, but yeah, he, I'm glad you went stun guard here. Hopefully that means he's going slow and stun guardy which is absolutely perfect for Spellwolf because I will be reducing his power and I have Soap 1, so basically I'll have a effective like, plus 3 um, on, the, on the damage that fits here. Yeah, perfect! Perfect, perfect. In fact, he's going to hit me for 0 here. <laughs> so, wow. Yeah, that's... So you can see how the damage gap really adds up. Uh, you know, I, I think I had a couple beats where I was like three ahead, and you know, if you're three ahead in three turns, I'm nine ahead, which is just, just huge, just huge. So, yeah. All right, I guess uh, we'll go crazy murder mode now. So, um. Since I'm gonna be going to crazy murder mode, I want to corner myself so he can't dodge. Uh, but I actually am gonna probably do murder mode 
Hurry up, let's do this. With dodge. So let's start here. Let's do here. And then um, I will dodge and change forms. And then um, even though he's at 9, uh, Kalistar can hit like a great train. So I'm trying... I'm wondering to myself if I want to... Uh, if I want to... Nah, but we'll do it. Let's see how much reach Kalistar really has. Um, I think I can kill him in, easily in two hits. Once I go really crazy mode, so... Let's, let's do that. Ah, that um, I think he's gonna perhaps dodge this round? Um... I really hope he dodges this round, because then I'll be in murder mode and his dodge will be down. That would be ideal. Um, come on, dodge. Dodge. Oh. Oh, actually, that's fine. He will not gain any life or anything, so I'm gonna dodge by him. Alright, perfect. Um, he doesn't have a move, because uh, I'm not gonna hit him. So he's gonna be stuck in the corner, and I'm gonna be in murder mode. Uh, this means that. He can, even if he dodges, he'll still be within range of something like shot. So he's going to be in real rough shape here. Um, yeah. Here we go. I'm going to catch myself in fire. Now, now that I'm in murder mode, every round I'm taking a damage, because I'm murdery, and all of my attacks do plus two power and plus two priority. So I'm really fast. I'm also really dangerous. It's funny because um, Magdalene level 2 does that as well. She has plus 2, plus 2. But my styles are significantly more scary um, than Kalistar. So, what we'll start out with, I think, is a fast shot. So, let's see. Plus 2, plus 2. If I go 5, how fast would she go? Um, looks like she's like minus one or plus one, so she can hit me for quite a bit here. Five, yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. I guess we'll go right with the additional range. Yeah. Okay, so this will be likely faster than anything she does. If she dodges, I can still get within range because it's plus zero to plus one range. Um, and I'm hitting her for half her life, which is kind of the goal here. Try to finish her off and two hit. Um, I don't think she can dodge me here, and I don't think she can go faster. I have seven, so the fastest she can be is five, six, and eight. So she can go faster if she does specifically that move. Go fast. Go fast. Plus one power. Hmm. Only plus one priority. The reason I'm doing priority here actually is that if he does this move, if he's going for this move, by doing the plus two priority, it actually forces him to do plus two priority. Which is good because I'm trying to, to wear out his focus meter. So. Yep. Poison party use. Yep, that's what I thought. So this means it's gonna be hitting me for four um, faster than me. Um, and it's gonna be past my stun guard. So anything stun guard doesn't matter. I'm actually okay getting hit for four here. Um, I was able to bring this meter, which is good. So yep. Yep. yep, yep, yep. Too bad. Called the move too late. Yeah. All right. Oh, this means he's gonna dodge me next turn. How sad is that? Dang. Ow. So, uh, murder mode is dangerous. I'm currently, uh, I was like nine ahead, and now I am not. 
Oh boy, I've made a move. Yeah, done. Alright. We're just gonna continue with the plan, I guess. He's going to dodge me as well, huh? So... Is there anything I can do about that? I think there is. Too bad, really. Hmm. Definitely gonna dodge me this turn. Huh. Do I have a move? Do I hit? Power. I mean, okay, maybe I can clash his dodge. That's probably what I should do. So let's assume that dodge is five. We're running out of time. Oh my gosh! Drive, 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 drive. I don't have drive. Oh no! <laughs> panic! I panic. It all went so wrong. Alright, well he'll dodge by me and I'll end up in the corner, I guess that's okay. Oh man, the panic. That was, that was terrible. <laughs> I knew what I wanted to do too late. Learn your moves so you can be quick. It'll be like me. Yep, dodge for sure. That's yeah. All right, so he'll dodge by me, and then he dodge me down. So what are you gonna do? Advance one. I will retreat two. Distance here. And then. Oh, his safety will be up though. Back off. Plus, can't take more damage than the level. Plus, three. So, he'll take five. Hmm. I guess I'm fine with that. And maybe. Yeah, yep. Hmm. Interesting. Alright. Here we go. So I assume he's gonna do safety, which means he's gonna take five. And I'm so doing mission here is pretty bad. I guess I could do well take five. His blessing. I guess I could push him out of range of blessing. Otherwise, then I'm not really doing anything. Yeah, I'm gonna. That's interesting. I could do this. That will push him out of range of blessing on the next two dollars plus some power. Okay, we'll try this. Um, I'll do the advance on me. He could do okay. I don't think he has any way to advance here. He could get range. He could burst, but I'll have range if he bursts. And I should be faster than you guys, hopefully. Do the math. You know, math is overrated. I guess I'm gonna go plus some power here. What's he doing? Adding priority? Adding stun guard. I will definitely add a power to that. Do you use strike or something? Yes. I'll be pushing him back, so I think I'll be okay. For every two turns, I have to have some. I can't be in safety. Yeah, it's definitely. Okay. That's what I thought. Ow. 
definitely go faster. Take five, two, five. And then the question is do I pull him towards me or do I push him away? I think the answer is pull him towards me. This way you can't dodge one. Actually, you just dodge the last one. Maybe that's not good. Crap. Maybe that's not good. Oh, I guess you can use the after and see if you can keep up right here. Interesting. I was doing much better in, in the soap way than the finishing way. Okay. My next one I'm hitting for a million, but you can get out of range here. Just as strong as Bellatar. Dang it, Maggie. That would be an awesome. <laughs> hmm. How fast can she go? She can go real fast. I think she's going to do spiritual grasp again. Here's that last time. How do I beat spiritual grasp? How do I beat spiritual grasp? I don't know. Yeah, so it's 8 9. 8 9. I don't think I can get that. I need 4. Yeah, I don't think I can get that. Dodging seems crazy. Spiritual Grass hits for. Yeah, Spiritual Grass kills him too. Okay, well, I'm gonna dodge. Which seems crazy and. At Kalasar, but hey. Oh, well then he can dodge you the turn after then. Mm, I guess I'm gonna switch Sure. That way I'll stop punching myself for the next He's definitely going for her spiritual grasp, or some sort of grasp. Cal, speed me, and go for the KO over here. Yeah. Well, I wasn't able to really get the, uh, be, be showing how Reach works with Kalistar. Again, I haven't played Kalistar much, but um, I was able to hit for five, but it's hard to hit with Kalistar when you're playing with the three. Um, but yeah, we will switch back to our human form when I'm not killing myself as a turn. Alright, he's definitely going for speed, which we're actually. Totally happy about because I knew he was going for that grass move, which we will dodge. Um, hey, look at that. He went for speed. It wasn't the grass, but it was fast. We will end up being on the top. Gets over here. He can drive into me. It stinks. Close. This stinks because this means he still has grass with an option. He can go really fast. Ooh, boy. Let's do. I guess I should have ran to the center. I usually give him more options. Okay. Well, what do we do here? I think the answer is something crazy, maybe. Do I do something crazy? I don't know. Hmm. Oh, I do play. What are you doing? Still outspeed me. Because it was 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. He needs to go 9. Boy, I can burst it though. 
and then he would miss. Hmm, interesting. So I burst it, and he would go. He shot it down. He drive it down. So burst is really good here. Okay. So shot it down, drive it down. So I guess we'll go. Let's do this. Optic. Yeah. I don't know what he's gonna do here. I guess he's soaking. But I have soaked three. So, even with his most powerful attack, it's gonna be seven, five, six. Oh, uh, he's still getting me. Maybe? No, that doesn't have the range. Yeah. I think we got it here. Dang. I missed or something. Yeah. Maybe? Being hopeful, he probably could dodge me. I don't know. Dead? Probably dead. <laughs> uh, grass! Do grass! Yes! Yes! That is game, sir! Oh yeah! I will retreat, Ron. Come to me. Oh no! Is this move one? Oh, it's move one. That means we can retreat one. Oh! Back off. Oh no! Oh, I had to figure out range, didn't I? Oh, I did! Oh, I'm a fool! Oh no! No! Oh! Hurts. I am a fool. Yep, we're three one. Dang it! I had the game. <sighs> oh man, that hurts. Wow. Now he has shot. Oh man. <laughs> Such a kick in the pants. Wow. Well, I guess we can go volcanic grass. If he goes shot, I can outspeed it. I think even. Let's see, three. I think. No, he could go spiritual shot. That would make him have speed to it. I don't think. Oh, I can also have speed to it. Hmm. Do I just try to clash him? I think I do. He's completely insane, probably. I think I'm gonna go for the clash. I think he'll go for this. To be speed six, but everything else doesn't have range on it. Yeah. I think he's gonna go for that and go speed six. But we will go for the clash okay, to make up for my stupid mistake. And then when we clash, we will have to do probably dodge or burst or something. And then um, I can probably do stubble. Only. No. Uh, Uh, here we go, clash, 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 yes! Okay, so I think his only options here is to either dodge me or burst me. So if I do spell bowl, that means he's gonna have to dodge me in the face. Yeah. Which I actually am fine with. So. Yep, dodge. I mean, I can dodge right here. Which is fine. I'm gonna get somewhere. <laughs> Just 
game is still going. Oh my gosh, I could have won last week. That was cool. Still, I'm gonna try to be in player, I guess. So, if I'm gonna be in with player, what am I gonna do? What's my fastest move? I guess Pride is probably the side best move next turn. He cannot dodge me, so. We will grab center, and we will go for Pride. I don't know if I can beat him. Uh, even with that, he still might be faster. He can also go drive and have plus three, so he can technically find me if he does switch, I guess. Yeah, we'll see if he does it. Alright, we're gonna go for the... My fastest attack. I have full board. My fastest attack, he cannot dodge me to solve his down. Um, the only way you can time me is if he can go um, switch drive. And I'll have second clock. So, we just get to plus three priority and I lose three life. So, I'm going to one here. All part of the plan. So, if he ties into a switch, his other options are going to be. Burst, which is slow, shot, which is slow, strike, which is blessing, which doesn't affect. So, essentially, if I anti-power and priority here, I think I can beat him, because I think I can outspeed all of his options. Uh, let's see. Oh, not really. Oh, I should have moved one space away. My only other option is to be shot. It's not good. Not good at all. Hmm. Well, we definitely do priority. He'll do priority. We'll do power. He'll do power, I guess. And then, uh, and then, uh, interesting. Did he call my clash? That's the question. Easy clash. I assume he is. He's good. So good. So good. Um, yes. Mm, yeah. If he does shot. Good, my opponent. I don't know what he's doing. Hmm. I think I'll be dead there. <laughs> he will counter my shot with shot. Striker is nothing. I can't hit anymore. Dang. What? <sighs> <sighs> <laughs> oh, is he really gonna? Oh, he's gonna um, he's gonna burst for the win. Oh man, Darren Kid. You're, you're awesome. Triple clash into the burst. Look at that. Wow. Wow. That was... That was Reed's. That was super Reed. So, anyway, so we talked about uh, damage gap, and we talked about re reach, and uh, we saw me get crushed because my opponent knows what the heck he's doing. Uh, really good game here again. Um, yeah, just, uh, just got outplayed. But uh, yeah, anyway, I hope uh, you learned something tonight uh, from my loss, and uh, I hope uh, you'll watch me again later. Take it easy. Bye.